हेलो फ्रेंड्स सब्सक्राइब टेक्नोलॉजी एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकॉन टू नेवर मिस द अपडेट्स hey what is up guys welcome back to our channel technology so today in this video i'm going to show you guys how to run kali linux operating system in your windows 10 or 7 or 8.1 computer without any cd dvd or pen drive so you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel technology so first of all you need to download this uh, kali linux image from this website is which is kali linux uh, kali uh, .org slash download so after go to this website you have to download the 64 bit or 32 bit version on your computer so i will give you the link on my video description you can download uh, from the direct link or you can use torrent link okay so after download kali linux iso on your computer you have to download unit boot in uh, so i will give you the link on my also on my video description so after go to this website you have to click on this download windows which i have already downloaded on my computer as you can see here is a unit boot in and here is a kali linux iso file so before i am going to start my video make sure that you have backup your os or you have created uh, one bootable dvd or pen drive of your windows 10 or windows 7 or windows 8 whatever uh, ways you are using on your computer because if anything goes wrong uh, i will not responsible for that so make sure that you have uh, you have a backup plan if if your operating system will crash okay so <clears throat> now what you have to do you need to open this unit uh, boot in on your computer after that click on yes as you can see here is the interface so what you have to do you need to click on this this image after that you have to select here ISO and now you have to click over there and you have to select your ISO file here's my ISO file as you can see which is under desktop to so select that uh, ISO file and after that from here you have to select hard uh, disk okay so now what you have to do you need to select your drive in my case it is showing c drive so i will select here c drive which is my main operating system uh, uh operating system uh, drive okay so now what you have to do you need to click on okay button over there so it will take some time to uh, copy all these files on your uh, c drive so you have to wait for a few minutes So after extracting is done you will get a interface like this so what you have to do you need to click on reboot now to log in with uh, kali linux operating system so after reboot you will get a two option over there one is windows 10 and another one is unit boot in so you have to log in with unit boot in and after that press enter so now you have to press escape button from the left side corner on your keyboard and you will get this window so you have to uh, select live system and press enter So now as you can see I'm successfully log in with my Kali Linux operating system. So if you want to remove Kali Linux operating system from your computer or if you want to go back to your uh, main operating system then just follow my process just open this terminal from here and after that type over there reboot. Also you can use this button to restart your computer just click on this button and after that click on this uh, and after that you will you have to click on restart. So I will use uh terminal to reboot the computer so after you will get this screen so you have to choose here windows 10 
and now you have to put your password and here what you have to do if I'll go to my C drive as you can see all the Linux file is uh, showing over there so now what you have to do you need to again open the unit boot in and click on yes and after that it's showing uh, like currently installed remove the existing version so you'll get this option so to click on ok so after done you will get a uninstall uh, notification so click ok over there and now go to c drive again and refresh this page as you can see all the linux file is gone from my c drive so i hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or questions then comments down below I will see you guys in the next one, next video. Take care.